San Luis Obispo County is set to move back into the red tier tomorrow, easing COVID-19 restrictions countywide. And this is what the status of the Central Coast looks like, with Santa Barbara County remaining in the most restrictive purple tier. KSBY News reporter Alexa Bertola has a look at what this means for businesses and schools moving forward in San Luis Obispo County. The last time San Luis Obispo County was in the red tier was at the end of September. Now the county was in that tier for about seven weeks before going back to the most restrictive tier. Local business owners I talked with are hopeful for the new loosening of restrictions once again. Paso Terra restaurant in the heart of downtown Paso Robles will be back to indoor dining at 25% capacity come Wednesday. We're hoping this time it's a go, go and that we will continue to move forward. Owner Christina Aversing says they will continue to use their parklet along with the new inside seating. I'm really anxious, I think like all of us, to get back to normal. My girls that work for me now, my servers, they've never seen the restaurant when it was regular. That's how crazy it's been. The red tier means more businesses can open indoors, including movie theaters at 25% capacity. Park Cinemas has been shut down for almost a year with brief reopenings in July and October. My entire life is in the theater business in San Luis Obispo County and I certainly want to make sure that we remain in the theater business. They created a GoFundMe, which raised more than $18,000 to help pay for bills. The owner says since the pandemic started, they've racked up $1 million in debt. We won't close down again. I'm done. This either stays open or we stay open without permission. That's all there is to it. I, I can't do this anymore. Park Cinemas will reopen March 12th. The list of showings are still being nailed down. In the meantime, they're planning to apply for the shuttered venue operators grant. Entering into the red tier also allows for middle and high schoolers to learn in person. Most local districts will return in the middle of March. Gyms and fitness centers can reopen indoors as well at 10% capacity and retail shops at 50% capacity under the red tier. The new changes are bringing a glimmer of hope. So we will see and hopefully we'll be able to keep our numbers down and thus move into the orange. For a list of businesses that can reopen under the red tier, head to our website, ksby.com. In Paso Robles, Alexa Bertola, KSBY News.